Hey guys, welcome back. It's time for another Shop My Stash. It's been a while since we've done one of these together, so I figured let's go ahead and get one up for this week so that we can see what, what, what I'm going to use for the week, what I'm going to wear. So as you know, I usually start up here to see if there's anything that I am wanting to use for the week, and I don't think that there is. So I'm just going to skip right over this top part and move us right into the first drawer. So the first thing that I already know I want to use this week is the Too Faced Life's a Festival Highlight. I used this the very first week that I picked it up and I have been kind of using other things so far and it's time to kind of put this one back to use. So as you already know this is the one that looks like a rainbow. It looks very festival and it's got a ton of glitter. So this is what's going to be used. Look at that glitter. It looks so amazing. So that's what's going to be on the um on the menu for this week as a highlighter. So let's grab one more for those days where we don't want super chunky highlights. Okay, so we're gonna pick one more um, so that we've got like a couple of different things to choose from and I think I want to go in with, um, yep, so Show Gold by MAC is one of the extra dimension highlighters and I haven't used it in a while and I figure it's time to put it to use again. So, so pretty. Let's use that one. So we've got our two highlighters for the week. Let's move on to blushes. So a couple of things that I want to use. One is, I already know I wanna use this one, Gold Rush. I did a review on this one and I have really been putting this one to use lately. I love it because when you do a more smoky eye, this is really perfect. It's like an apricot shade that just, it. I don't know, it looks very, very natural, but it looks like the perfect flush of color. Had somebody comment to the video the other day saying it doesn't show up on them, but I did not have that issue. So we're going to grab that for the week. And then let's grab, now since that one is kind of like a nude color, <clears throat> let's grab one that has a little bit more pigment. And I think let's use this one. This was part of the holiday collection sometime back. It is called Sweet Vision. Mm, oh, I don't know if I want to use... Do I want to use that or do I not want to use that? Let's just use that. <laughs> oh my goodness. Blushes for me are the most indecisive. That's why blush palettes for me are the way to go. But that's what that looks like. It's like a peachy pink, very pretty. Also gives you like a perfect flush of color. And I think we're good with blushes for the week. So. Down here, we are at bronzers, so I already know. I'm gonna use Hoola, haven't used this one in a while, and let's, we're gonna use a, a foundation this week, I think, that requires bronzer, and so let's just see. I keep all my brushes in here, but you know Hoola, just your typical matte natural bronzer. Um, it's not very deep, which makes it perfect for my skin tone. Um, especially because I haven't been going to the pool. It's still, you know, we're still waiting for the pool to open. So I don't want to overdo it and make it look like I've been at, you know, at the beach when I really haven't. So I think we're good with that for now. Um, as far as extra, do we want to use anything from this drawer? This is obviously the one that has all my individual, um, shadows in it and I don't know I feel like I want to use like a moon dust shade this week but hmm. okay so diamond dog space cowboy is so pretty it might end up being that one ooh soul no, it might be that one. <laughs> and then we have intergalactic. Okay, you know what? I want to use Solstice. This is that kind of blue-brown pigment type shade, but it, oops, it looks um, super sparkly. That's so, so pretty. Okay, put that one to use this week. Hasn't been used in quite some time. Other than that, I think we don't need anything from this drawer. So let's move on. Do I have anything in there? Nope, I have a, <laughs> you know what that means? I have a drawer for 
extra makeup. Okay. Now let's get into the eyeshadow palettes. So, mm, this Violet Voss Rainbow Palette is so amazing. It's just got a ton of bright colors. Mm, do I want to put bright colors to use? I already know one of the ones that I want to use, but you know what? I haven't used the chocolate gold in quite some time, and this one is so, so pretty. So I think we're going to use this one for this week. Um, okay, I know what I want to use. I already have it in my mind. Okay, so let's use the chocolate gold. We're going to use the Jouer Skinny Dip. And I'm going to, that means I'm going to have to get a all matte palette. So I'm probably going to get like the tart, tartest, tart, tartlet palette. If I can get this thing open. Hold on. There we go. This is, this palette is so amazing. I just love it. So, so pretty. Look at that. And I hardly went in at all. Yep. We're totally doing that one this week. So let's grab that. Okay. We're done here. I'm going to put all of our goodies on the desk and I'll be right back. So I actually did a real quick switcheroo. I traded out the Too Faced Life's a Festival rainbow highlight for the um, Bord de Plage. Um, I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, highlight palette by NARS because with so much glitter going on with the eyes, um, I thought the last thing I probably need is glitter eyes and glitter cheeks. <laughs> oh my goodness. I opened this up and then it just closed right back on me. Okay, here we go. So basically this is just a palette um, of bronzers and highlighters by NARS. NARS, in my opinion, has some of the best um, highlighters out there as far as it being like a more wet sheen and so I'm gonna use this instead and that way I can make it a little bit more neutral on the cheeks and not have such a like rainbow glow all over my face um, what with those two right there so I ended up grabbing those I grabbed the boring stuff so things like the um, highlighting base I grabbed the what's up and the physicians formula in the shade let's see what is this champagne this is one of my favorites for um, a highlighting base for a cream highlight this thing is intense on its own and then when you put powder on top of that it just takes it to the next level so I also grabbed my Cabrow by Benefit one of my favorite brow products of all time my glitter glue by Too Faced my Tarte Tartist double ended eyeliner this I got at the 21 days of beauty for Ulta and it has been so incredible I have not loved a felt liner this much in well never let's just put it that way the Essence um, black eyeliner the long lasting 16 hour liner has been the only one I have ever found to stay in my waterline for that long. <laughs> and it was like $3 at Ulta, so I am super impressed with that. And then just my Too Faced mascara that came in my Sex on the Peach set. It's not my favorite, but I'm going to use it up and put it to use. I hate to waste it um, when I spent the money on the set. So <laughs> that is what we have there. So I'm going to take us now over to foundations so that we can select one from there. Okay guys, so it looks, the lighting's a little bit, um, I mean obviously not as good in here because we're in, basically we're in a drawer. <laughs> but um, for this week, I don't know what I'm feeling as far as foundation. I think I'm just going to wear my Fenty foundation. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just going to grab this. Nothing beats this. I love it so much. I also went to grab my Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. It was still in my Sephora bag from my Sephora haul video from literally a few minutes ago. And so I went rummaged through my bag to grab this. So that's why that appears there too. So we've got the Fenty Foundation. We're going to do the Silk Canvas Primer. Let me take you into my drawer and we are going to... Um, Let's see, with the Fenty foundation, that means I'm probably going to want to do shape tape. So let's do shape tape for the week, and that way, yeah, let's do shape tape for the week. Um, and then for what I have been using nonstop for my under eye powder, and then to set 
So basically to set the concealer and to set the concealer, it's on my eyelids for eyeshadow is, um, are these two right here. I kind of alternate between Halo and Enhance and they've been working really, really well. This is from the Tarte Park Avenue Princess um, palette. So we're going to use that as well. So let's put this bad boy over here. And let's move that up here, so that way, um, that looks better. Okay, so I think we have everything we need except for lip products. So let's start rummaging in our lip products so that we can figure out what we want to wear. Okay, so one of the ones I already know I want to wear is, actually let's take, um, okay. Let's take two. I'm going to take two from last year's um, summer collection by MAC. I'm going to take Calm Heat and CC Me. If you watched my MAC part one of my MAC collection, you would have seen the swatches for these, but let me open them up real quick and that way you can see what they look like. So one of them's an uber nude, kind of almost that concealer type nude, but I, that's right up my alley. I love that type of. <laughs> Of a shade and then the other one is a more like I guess magenta is the word but it's really pretty it's like a really good pop of color um, especially if I'm going to wear certain sparkly shades I will kind of try to tone it down just a little bit and then probably you know what let's do one bright color so we've got a nude we've got the magenta that's kind of like in the middle and then let's do a bright color so I'm gonna take you to my lipstick stash and the one I'm thinking I'm going to want to use is this one by Huda Beauty, and it is called Wild Child. It's this one right here. It was part of the summer collection last year. I love this shade. This shade is really amazing. This one's really good, too, but it's more of an orangey red, and I don't want to use that quite yet. What is this called? Oh, this one's called Mamacita. <laughs> okay, so I think we're going to use this one. That, we, that way we have everything covered. I think it would be nice to use a gloss. Let me see. I need to put some of these glosses to use. Um, let's see. Um, I did get one from that Mac Nico Panda collection that is so pretty, but again, it's also sparkly. And I don't know. I'm really wanting. Hmm. Um, I do want a gloss. I haven't used this one in a while, but that's not the kind of gloss. Ew, it's like separating. I'm gonna have to mix that one up a little bit. Um, here we go. Let's use this one. This is the. Is this angelic? Yep, this is the Huda Beauty Angelic shade. Super pretty. This is part of the strobe glosses so pretty so we're gonna use that okay guys I think we have everything covered um let's just kind of do a rundown so we've got the concealer and then the powder to set the concealer <clears throat> we've got the face primer and foundation I have got eyeshadows ah I wanted to use the tart tartlet for matte shades because I know that those two palettes I selected don't have that so, no, that's not it. That's the Tartlet in Bloom. And I'm going for this regular Tartlet palette. So let's use this one only because it's got all matte shades. And that way I have got something to put like in my crease and stuff. Um, so I think we're good. Okay, we've got eyes. <clears throat> we've got mascara. We've got liner glitter glue. I've got that little single guy right there. I've got highlight. I know we've got blush covered over there. We've got lipstick, brows. I think we're good. I don't know. I always end up <laughs> realizing afterwards what I'm missing, but I think that's everything. I think we're good to go. And now I am all set for the week. You guys know I love doing this. Keeps me a little more organized and less it's less hectic for me at the start of my day. So this is awesome. I think we're good to go. Thank you guys so much for sticking out this Shop My Stash with me. Thank you for helping me pick out my makeup for the week. I hope this inspires you and gives you ideas of what to pick out from your stash as well. All right, guys. Until next time. Talk to you soon.
Bye.